This is Pete Feenstra on Friday the 11th of November. 11, 11, 11. Doesn't happen very often. Talking to the legendary keyboard player, flautist and multi-instrumentalist, and the man who keeps focus going the year 2011, Mr. Tice Man Beer. Great to have you here, Tice. Hello, Pete. Great to have you here. Unbelievable that you're still touring and, and you're pulling bigger crowds than ever before. Yeah. I should say we're doing this interview for GetReadyToRock.com because I forgot, but I'm tired. It's been a long week. Let's talk about the recording side of Focus first, Ty. So you're now on what, Focus 9 or Focus 10? No, Focus 9 was done already two years ago. Right. I was that talking. was with, yeah, <laughs> that was with Niels van der Steenhoven, yeah. the guitar player. And Niels left us after five years of very successful playing. Great player. And he gave the guitar, I mean, yeah. to his teacher, Menno Kochis. Wow. Who is a monster. And uh, Mano's very well known in his own right in Holland, of course. Oh, yeah. And, uh, and he's played in Focus before, hasn't he? That's true. Yeah. yeah. That was in 97, 98. Ah. And there we, uh, we had a few concerts and then it died and it was reborn. Just when when was that exactly when you said? Uh, halfway 2000. Yeah. So the new Focus actually exists longer than the old Focus ever. Yeah, that, that's, the, that's the case for quite a few bands, funnily enough, who are in your position. Yep. And one of the reasons for that, of course, is that there seems to be a huge, huge upswing in, in classic rock, prog rock, rock in general, and bands who've been around as long as you have. Yeah. Are you finding that to be the case generally? I don't know. I don't feel uh, being familiar with any trend or uh, fashion, you know. Right. I think we made music always non-fashionable. And uh, maybe the songs were strong enough to hold, you know, yeah. to, to, to ab abide yeah, yeah. the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I call that the English. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's, that's and I'm very glad that also not only the, the people of my age, but there are people, very young people that come to our concerts now, you know, they rediscover our yeah. music, which is wow, God given, you know. And one of the reasons they rediscover you is that you had another hit again because of the World Cup. Mm. And uh, every time Andy Adverts on up, it pops focus. It was fantastic. Great yeah. publicity. Was that as popular in Holland as it was here? Oh, man. Can I say Nike without yeah. making yeah, no, one? Yeah. We're not going to get paid. Nike. <laughs> Nike had a film of three and a half minutes with a Rooney in it, with yeah, was a very a famous one, fader, yeah. but not playing tennis, but table tennis. Yeah. Yeah. You know. And a fantastic film made by a very famous Hollywood uh, producer. Wow. Uh, and they chose Hocus Pocus by phone wow. as the main theme. Yeah. So, Which kind you know of how many people look yeah. at, uh, yeah. at, uh, at the YouTube? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 130,000, yeah. 130 million. Yeah. Which is a lot. Half of whom are coming to Sutton tonight, of course. <laughs> yeah, if, if it's only half, it's okay. Yeah. Anyway, so we talked about Focus 9. Focus 10 mm -hmm. is in the pipeline. I think you've, you've No, Focus 10 is more rock and roll. Yeah, but I mean, it's, it goes it's, back it's, to the roots more than ever. Okay. Focus 8 was a stepstone. Focus 9 was another one. And now Focus 10 is, is probably going to be a, 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 a milestone. Yeah? That's what I smell. Yeah. Okay. I you smell, smell a monster. Monster. <laughs> <laughs> That was some fitting probably would say. Yeah, yeah. And we, uh, can we you tell smell us, not rubber. Can you tell us about what we can expect on that? Yeah. yeah. Good stuff? All, all, all yeah. recorded? All yeah, recorded? yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything is recorded. Everything has been mixed already. Okay. In a very aggressive way, very beautiful also. But we wait actually for the sleeve of Mr. Okay. Master Roger Dean. Wow. You remember Roger yeah, Dean? Yeah, yeah, the only yes, 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 yeah. Many other, yeah. You know. Ah, that's Menno. Menno, join us. Yeah. And here's Menno, the guitar player, we've just been talking about. He's our new star. Hey, guys. Menno. Hey, Menno, great to have you here. Great to be here, man. You've been back in the band how long? Since January, officially. And uh, you were in them in the late 90s. Does it, does it feel any different? No, it doesn't feel any different. Well, it is different because it's a different lineup, you know, so yeah. you're working with other people. Yeah. But you were familiar with the stuff, or most of the stuff? And yes, yeah, well, it was kind of, you know, it was kind of 
a stressful situation when I had to replace Niels a year yeah. ago. So I did four gigs with them already. That was kind of, they flew me into Southampton. Okay. I had to play for 700, yeah, okay. I had to play for 700 people and like three hours later or something. So I did yeah. Way to go, way to go. <laughs> just, just as you came in there, we were talking about Roger Dean. So what was the connection with him? With yeah, the thing was that I was always an admirer already, you know, with uh, the, the things he did, the big sleeves of the vinyl yeah. for Yes and for other artists. Yeah. I was in Visa. And, uh, and now you're right. Nowadays it's a CD yeah. sleeve, of course. Yeah, but that's all, you know, that's minimal. But yeah. we are also going to make a final of. Uh, Oh, yeah, that seems to come back. Yeah, that would be great. Yeah. And uh, there's a guy that works in our management. We have the manager now. His name is Martin, Martin Darwin. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And Darwin has a new right hand, and that's Daniel Earnshaw. Oh, okay. And Earnshaw come, comes to my house in Holland for the first time to make some films about me playing the grand piano at home. Ah. He made a DVD or uh, whatever, ah. I don't know how he calls it. And we also sell it on the merch, you know. Ah. It's just me on, on the piano with all the mistakes and all the shit. You know? And next week we're going around your house. <laughs> <laughs> now, and then he told already that he had connection with Roger Dean. Oh, ah, okay. And then, and then Him being 26 years old, I thought, yeah. such a young guy. Wow. What should he have with Roger Dean? But he had a very uh, regular correspondence with Roger Dean, and he knew about uh, all about Roger Dean. And he was already suggesting then that maybe there would be a possibility of combining Roger and Focus, Great. which was a very long, Process. A go process yeah, yeah, that I yeah, yeah. thought, okay, Roger is too expensive. Oh, yeah. I, I never, we never can pay him, you know. Yeah. So like a like a dream, dream, uh, like a u utopia. Yeah, yeah. You know? yeah. But it worked and it's happened. It's gonna work. It's gonna happen. It's gonna but it takes some time. Yeah. Roger, so you, it's you, Roger's you, fault. Yeah. But it's still done. But do you hurry up, Roger? But do you give him some things for him to Man. work out? He showed us last time. We showed each other what's in. Yeah, I was somewhere called? last week. Where was it? Boundaries, mm -hmm. boundaries, fletching. I you know that. Somewhere. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. near here. Yeah, yeah. Fletching. fletching. Yeah, yeah, fletching. Yeah, right. fletching. Oh, right. And he had a small, very beautiful <coughs> exhibition of his main work. He did for yes. Yeah. He did for yeah. other groups. Excellent. And the same time. At the same night, at the opening of his exhibition, we played. And we had a very serious talk with him. Yeah. And he had some sketches of oh, I did. And oh, that's, I'm not oh, going to review to you. Oh, no, okay. that's, we'll that's a secret. We'll wait for that. So this album could be out in the spring of next year? Something like no, that? No, sooner. I think sooner. sooner. Oh, great. Around Christmas or a little, a little later. Uh, and for people who don't see you, well, this is the last night of the tour, so I guess there could yeah. be people in Europe. But, uh, Oh, sorry. That's probably Roger Dean as we speak. So, uh, Who is this? hold this. Yeah. This is the live interviews you can tell. Yeah. We had. Uh,